A gallery exhibit here in New York City is raising a lot of eyebrows. They're snapshots of the most intimate and private moments, putting a sleeping child to bed, napping. The pictures were taken by artist Arnie Svensson from his apartment across the street using a telephoto lens. Now the photos are the subject of an exhibit called The Neighbors and are on sale for as much as $8,000 each. Svensson argues he's done nothing wrong. The gallery describes the photos as, quote, social documentation. You can't tell who they are, so I think it's fine. I think they're, I love that too. It's mysterious. I love them. And while no faces are fully visible, residents of the luxury building argue it's an invasion of privacy. I don't feel comfortable knowing that someone was pointing a camera into our places with a telephotic lens. I'm sure there's a lot we haven't seen, and I don't know what he has on film. What else is there, and what else... Is he planning on doing with them? Once uh, two of the neighbors found out that their children, very young children, were in the exhibit, they um, filed a complaint to stop him from selling the photographs and from continuing to show them. Uh, clearly, the judge believed that they were art. I think if um, his neighbors ended up on a billboard for Verizon or some sort of advertisement, um, it would have been a different situation. But what you have here, even if we're making money, um, he was saying something about privacy, about intimacy. It's pretty well established that when you're out in public, you have no reasonable expectation of privacy. So, for example, if you're walking down the street on the sidewalk and I take your picture and use it in an art exhibit, there's not a whole lot you can do about it. Um, in this case, it was it, it's sort of a murky area because they were um, they were in their apartments, although they were exposed because of the glass, obviously.